Hey, good morning. It is Saturday, November 23rd, about 9.30 in the morning. I'm getting ready to go out and clean up the barn. Um, we did two picks this week, and God, man, we brought a ton of stuff in. Um, I also, uh, I bought out an estate and got a bunch of uh, furniture. Some really nice stuff. Back in the day, it was real nice. I don't know, today, nobody likes it anymore. Um, wooden, walnut, brown furniture, they call it. Grandma's furniture. Um, nobody's liking it. So, we're getting really good deals on it. Um, but the cool thing about it is, it's, it's what goes in my house. I have company outside, sorry. Um, it's what works in my house. I don't want mid-century. I don't want shabby chic or whatever. I want stuff that fits the, the whole feel of the house, you know? So, um, we've been working on the house for a good couple of weeks. Um, two years ago, I had a big-ass flood. Um, all the hot water pipes froze, and every chandelier and fan in the house was just pouring water all over the place. It was... It wasn't a good thing. I, I, it really tested me and my patience and everything I had to stay here that day. It was the middle of January and it wasn't good. So after that, I kind of took a lot of time off from the house. I fixed the heat and just worked in two rooms, stayed in two rooms, lived in two rooms. And uh, finally last week we started Cleaning, getting it back together again, making it my house. So uh, I'll give you a quick look around, then we'll take a, a walk outside and show you all the crap that I got this week. But this is the furniture I got. Check it out. Uh, that's my piano. That's the old leather couch I had in the store. Um, picked up this cool hutch, and of course we broke the friggin' knob on the way in. Um, this is Thomasville furniture. Um, Really nice stuff. I guess it was real hot in the 70s and 80s, but it's quality piece, man. Really nice. I figured, screw it. You know what? If I, I'm lucky if I get 175 bucks for it, I'll keep it. Put it in my house. It fits. Got rid of the big claw and ball um, dining room thing I had here. Uh, it, it just, it looked like it came from a garage sale, so screw it. This is a little too formal, but, eh, you know what? Screw it. Why not? Picked up that piece from, actually, a relative of the ones I got this one from. Or, not a relative, neighbor. Picked that up last year, got that. This is my living room. It's still not quite together, but I'm working on it. Um... Anyway, take you outside. I think I got a customer, so I might have to cut this short. Um, crap, I do. All right, yeah, this is my mud room. Again, it's a work in progress. Where uh, the picture fell down. <laughs> All right, hunters or trappers are just leaving. Yes, I have a customer. This is like every day. Um, there's always somebody showing up. Unexpected. It's all good. Look at this day, huh? It's my backyard. Very cool. Pond starting to thaw out again. I gotta do a massive cleanup in here. Um, we've been cleaning the eBay room out. This is all from the eBay room. Good morning. Hi. Hi. We picked this up out of a basement on the job we're at. Um, I thought it was Tiger Oak. It fooled me. It's a faux finish. So, somebody will paint it. Do something with it. Couple customers. If you guys need a hand, just let me know, okay? Thank you. All right. Okay. Run the, oops, run the 
store. I got to turn on the lights. I'm not prepared again. Um, we picked this one up. Stereo Hi-Fi Mid-Century. Check this out. This was in a garage stored away. <laughs> Look at that. Still got records in it. It is a, a Zenith. Nice. Got a whole stack of records. I mean, nothing um, anybody's really going to like, I guess. But Jerry Bell. Oh, who doesn't like Jerry Bell? Sound of music. Ugh. Anyway, um, yeah, that's up for sale. I haven't plugged it in yet. But I assume it's going to work. Had that one. Have this one. Um, I have three of these. Three mid-century stereo high fuzz. Um, picked up this. Actually, it was where the stereo was. This is a very cool farm table. I can't get a good shot of it. Thing's about six feet long, 32, 34 high. Great green color. I put new barn wood on top. That's um I think they were floorboards from a job I did. I don't know. Um, pulled the organ out of my house. That's out. That was in the sitting room where that piece of furniture I just showed you was. Got a spinet piano. Check this out. This is a nice one. This just came in, so it's a little dusty. It was up in an attic. Um, wow. It's authentic. At first I thought it was a repro, but it's not. It's got chicken in it. Um, yeah, I think it's, it's, um, definitely old. Very nice file cabinet. Gotta be five feet high. <sighs> Looks like it's oak. Could be wrong. Uh, this just sold last week. So the file cabinet's gonna go there. Still got this guy. Oh. Look at him. It's pretty wild, huh? Got a great, I have a real hard time holding this thing. A cool fake leopard jacket, hooded jacket. Nice. Oh, now nah, she's naked. Hey, there he is. Uh, so, yeah, yeah, I brought these out. Um, I figured I'd, I'd put the leather couch in, switch it out for a little while. So, yeah, I wanted to make this fast, but obviously it's not working. So, maybe a little longer. Got these great cans. I don't know what it is about them. I guess because it's red and white and it's got some cool, uh, got a cool logo on it. They make great cans for, uh, like a, a garage shop. The dreaded man cave. That word I hate and not like. Um... I don't know. I just feel if a man needs a cave to live in, mm. what's, what's the house for? Anyway, uh, yeah, we got a ton of stuff. A ton. I've got three couches. Um, I don't know. I kind of like them. That's a mid, um, oh, shit, the name just went out of my head. I don't know. Got a couch chair set. Still got my wall unit I made. Pretty big one. So, um, I got these cool mid century chairs, yellow. Got these I pulled out of the, um, the convent in Norwich that just got torn down. The seats need to be redone. But kind of a cool look. I don't know where you'd put them. What else we got? We got the I Love Lucy living room set. <coughs> Excuse me. Plenty of plumbing. Wall hung sinks. Oh man, there's got to be 20 here. Corners and regulars. Cool set of urinals that'll make a great flower pot for somebody. Sorted furniture, 
chairs out the wazoo. Tons and tons and tons. Got that. And him. He's been hanging for a while. Church pews. Three church pews. We just pulled out. Uh, somebody dropped off a couple of uh, bench seats from Sievers. They're available. About four and a half feet long. Got some great chairs. Lots and lots of chairs. All this tchotchke stuff we pulled out of a pick. Clean up. Tons, tons, and tons. If you need some sort of weird Christmas gift, jump on it. There's four more tables of it. Um, kitchen table just came in. Uh, there's my claw foot from the living room. A couple of sort of chairs. Bicycles, trunks, beds. There's at least 20 beds back there. This is what we did last week. All that needs to be sorted and cleaned. Hello. How much do you get for the picture hmm? frames? They're all different prices. Okay. Pick out whatever you like and I'll let you know. Right. Okay. Pool chairs, old chairs. Big kick-ass Pepsi sign. That thing's at least, it got to be five and a half feet tall, six feet wide. Old ladders. There's the uh, spindles and posts from the, the convent we tore down. I, I didn't tear it down. Here's some close-ups on this bike. Everybody's been asking about it. And uh, here it is. It's got a bunch of cool work on it. I mean, the guy who did it knew what he was doing. Maybe a little too much to be dangerous, but... Or whatever. Uh, but it's got like a four-foot chopper front end on it a lot of cool work the pegs are a uh, bike chain got the devil tail oh I can't see sorry there's a bunch of crap on it but uh, the gas tank alone is pretty cool so yeah that's available come and get it a big kick-ass safe, a bunch of stereos. So that's it. Oh no, it's not. I wanted to do the eBay room. Forgot. Um, wow, we've been working on that. Um, I have a ton of stuff to pack up. Of course, it's going to be dark in here. Still looks like hell, <laughs> but. There's portions of it that we're reorganizing. Um, we're trying to trying to make it more uh, more organized. I have a packing station here with the scale. I just saw that TV a couple nights ago. It's got to go out. But uh, here's my packing station. This is where we do. Uh, it's so damn dark. This is where we do the um, the listings. This is where I take pictures. Um, it's like a little photo booth I made. So we try to just keep it keep it clean from now on. Everything's getting stacked and put in the right place. Um, trying to get some organization here. This is the cleaning station. Um, just picked up a bunch of cool vintage retro clocks. Clock radios, I love these things. <clears throat> Half the time they're beat to crap, but these are very good shape. Great old manual typewriter. And, uh, oh boy, we're working on this side. But it's coming. It's coming. Check these guys out. Just pick these up. I don't know what to think of them. Um, they're made of some sort of paper I guess it was wet and then shaped and then dried and painted you go either way on these They're just extremely creepy or extremely cool but it's like a nativity scene obviously um, I don't know they're about two feet tall smaller ones are about a foot 
They're up for sale if anybody's interested. Uh, Jason's here if you want them for Christmas. Available for parties. All right, I'm out. I know this went on way too long, but I wanted to show you some of the crap that's been going on and what we've been doing. Uh, it's been a while since I did one of these. It's Saturday. I'm not having a sale today. If somebody wants to come and take a look, come on up. Um, I'll be here. The sun's in my eyes. Um, yeah, so that's it. Again, this is going to be a YouTube video. There's a little uh, red button on the right-hand corner, bottom corner. Uh, hit that if you would. Subscribe. Um, you hit the like button or leave a comment. So I'm out. You guys have fun. I got to go take care of a couple people. See you later. Merry Christmas. Blah.